2011. I'm Kate Coleman, a NASA astronaut and also a UMass graduate. And it's my great pleasure to be here with you today in a sort of virtual way to just be part of this very special point in, in, in your lives where you get to look back at the things that you've done, many of which were hard, and realize that the possibilities for the future are, are limitless. You have the power of an education, and there's a lot that you can do with that. And I'm just really happy to, to be able to um, be here with you today. I do actually want to challenge you today to something that I think is important, and that is that when I looked out at the Earth as an astronaut, I see a very, very beautiful place, but also, as, as one of my crewmates likes to call it, he calls the Earth a fragile oasis. You look down and, and you know you see a landscape, and then when I listen to the news, I you know hear more about what's actually happening on that landscape that I can't see. And I realize that our world is a fragile place and it has a lot of different difficulties to make a difference. But what I am really trying to say is that I think that the solutions are going for the future are made up of more than just you as individuals, but you as part of a team that you build, as a team that you are a part of. And if you look to your right and you look to your left, you see people that you may or may not know. And if you spend a few minutes talking to them, you'll know them a little bit better. And even if you spend a long time together, I think you'll know more about them. But people can always surprise you. And I think that you will bring the most to a team if you allow the people that you are working with, and that means the place that you work, the places that you, with your friends, that means in your family, in your, in your marriages, in your relationships. I think that if you can try to be open-minded and let people surprise you in the gifts that they bring to the team, I guarantee you that they bring some things that you don't, and you bring some things that they don't. And together, you make a more powerful team and I think that's what we need for the very difficult challenges that I see in our future, both here on the Earth and also in, in exploring our universe. I did actually bring a little, uh, a little piece of UMass with me, just to uh, have a little, a little bit of a little bit of place. And I will tell you that the bobble, the bobble head is actually pretty amusing up here on the space station. See if he stays up here after I'm gone or not. Congratulations, UMass class of 2011, and I look forward to your future. Goodbye.